Well, would you take a look at that? Three and a half hours from home and get here just in perfect time. For me, it's opening a grouse season. Hopefully I can knock a few of them down. We can get out and set them to Spurry Dog Town in the afternoon, make a good full day out of it. Hang around, folks. We'll be back. That is gorgeous today. Hey everybody, no place I'd rather be on the opening weekend of grouse season than out pounding grouse. You ever seen sharp tails? Not very big bird. Pretty little suckers though. And they are absolutely, absolutely the best eating. South Dakota is known for pheasants. Pheasants suck compared to these. Tail grouse and greater prairie chicken. They uh, they flock together uh, as far as shooting them, uh, three a day, mix match whatever. Beautiful little birds. Yeah, took me damn near four hours, probably ten miles of walking to do it, but we got her done. I was gonna do some prairie dogging, but we got about a fifteen, maybe a little more now. The wind is building. I'm gonna get these butchered up, get them on ice, see what's going on, but I don't think it's gonna happen. Thank you. Here's another little tip of the day. You guys hunt fish all the time. You always got Ziploc bags in your vehicle, in your boat, I do. You leave them in the little flimsy cardboard box, they come in, they fall apart. Next time you're in a sporting goods store, this is a tube, uh, it's a holder for take down fly rods. You know, they break down into pieces. They come this long, this long, this long. Get one about 20 inches long. Keep your Ziplocs in there. Keeps them clean. You know, piece of PVC pipe with the one cap glued on and the other one left loose do the same thing. Just a lot nicer. Tip of the day for you folks. Have a good one. Grouse are gonna be excellent on the table tonight.